G'day, Nigel Ruck here. Now, when I'm in the garden, I don't like to beat around the bush. I like to see all my plants in the optimum of health and looking absolutely sensational. Good soil and reliable water are, of course, very important, but don't forget, it's the ongoing nurturing and feeding that'll take things to another level. The magical properties of seaweed have been known to man for thousands of years. Farmers used to spread it over their crops with remarkable results, and in fact, I think they still do. Now, if you don't live near the coast, don't panic, because all of the harvesting and hard work has been done by sea salt. Sea salt is not by definition a fertilizer, but more an overall plant health tonic and growth stimulant that your plants just love, because it provides benefits that a normal fertilizer doesn't. Now, if we just take a second to suss out the sassy seaweed science, all will be revealed. Sea salt's key ingredient is bull kelp, only found in the pristine waters around King Island and the west coast of Tasmania. The massive seas of the Great Southern Ocean wash up mountains of bull kelp onto the beaches, and it's from here that the kelp is harvested. No marine forests are touched, making it totally sustainable. Now I could talk science all day, but it's the benefits of sea salt that you need to know. It stimulates strong root growth and beneficial soil microorganisms, promotes vigorous flowering and fruiting, and overall garden health. It helps plants cope with all kinds of stress from heat, drought, and frost, and it gives plants better resistance to sucking insects and fungal attack. It's safe to use on all plants, including natives, at any time. And it improves seed germination rates and reduces transplant shock. It helps to increase nutrient uptake, so when fertilizers are applied, they're much more effective. And best of all, it smells great.